Welcome to Reverse Sweep presented by USAA Insurance. We're going to do a little fun segment where Ian and John are going to duke it out over the best champs performance individually of all time. The single player in the single event, the single game that they think stands above all other showings at champs in Call of Duty history. So guys, uh, do you have someone in mind already? Do you need to think up someone who wants to go first? Easy. I already got, I'll like, go for I'll go first. Easy. I already got one. Oh, Shocking, Katie. Well, we're, pass it it, we're passing it back and forth. Katie, look. <laughs> the best individual performance at Call of Duty Champs is going to none other than Optic Gaming's very own formal in Infinite Warfare. It was the first time, well, the only time, the Dynasty got a COD Champs win the Optic Dynasty, but uh, I played at this event. I believe uh, I got like fifth, six. You know, I don't want to gas myself up too much but formal had the most insane event i think i've ever seen mm -hmm. in my life uh from top to bottom it didn't matter the mode i'm pretty sure overall like counting bracket play he had like a 1.5 kd which is unheard of not like an ikea that you see like legitimately a 1.5 mm -hmm. uh and he, he was just doing everything you know, they won two best of fives versus Envy in that uh, in that champs. But like it it was crazy. He looked by far like the best player uh mm -hmm. that I've ever seen. He was like Usain Bolt in his prime. You know what I'm saying? Where like he's just like jogging and he's still four feet in front of the next guy who's second. Mm -hmm. That was formal. So, yeah, but Damon Damon played the best on Sunday. Oh, Come here we go. Damon played the best on Sunday. Hey, well, who's Austin your who's had him your on pick? Swords on Saturday. Oh, well, not you know sword, I mean? not that much. Obviously, if he was doing what he was doing, one point five. <laughs> um, Pistola, two thousand ten, whooped in. <laughs> what? Bat. You can't. Pistola, no one dude. even knows who Pistola is. Probably. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna give it to a duo. Actually, I, it's hard for me to choose which one. If I leaned, I was gonna say Krim, but Krim Six and Aches and Ghosts That's a good one. champs. They were so dominant that I don't think they had one close match. Mm -hmm. And in the game five, Krim went like 11 and 0. Like game five itself wasn't close, and that was the closest they came to actually losing. They blew everyone out. I think they had like the most ridiculous duo respawn stats. Like maybe it wasn't one guy going off, but both of them, they had both 1.3s. One and five, John. How, one five. Okay, but you had two people. Okay, but you had two people with one threes actually just. Who they are they playing? Were who are they? Who are they playing in the finals? Envy. Oh, not in the finals. I meant. Oh, yeah, they're playing nameless. First off, but is, who was even playing back then? <laughs> Nature was still you? playing. Nature, got, I wasn't. I wasn't at Ghost Champ. Mm -hmm. It's because you couldn't qualify. You weren't good enough. Well, yeah, just, don't, yeah, don't no let more me forget theory, that no you more tried to qualify for. You were trying to qualify for champs. No more questions at this time. No more questions. Who were playing here? <laughs> you tried. I was. Bro. I was the youngest <laughs> still in the Call of Duty scene. Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! Yeah, you. You should that backfired on you pretty quick. I'm why I, I did that myself. <laughs> But yeah, and at the champs, they just, they hit another level. Everyone knew they were the favorite going in, but honestly, champs never works out that way, pretty much. It's very rare. And for them to do what they did was crazy. They made, you know, we were just talking about, we were talking about phase making it boring. They actually made that champs boring. Like they actually yeah. just ran through the competition and it was actually just boring. They won so easily. So I have to go. I have to give it to them. Like that's that's if it was my team, that's what I'd want. I want a bunch of boring matches to a dub, and that's what they did. All right. Well, I like this. I like this. Those are good. Uh, as always, when we do these, my mind's a bit more limited. But I have to go. Uh, I have to go with Simp in Black Ops Four. Uh, he came in as a rookie on United at Champs. He in almost pretty much every single series they played was just so overwhelmingly dominant. Like, do you guys remember Arsenal against Units? United With when he snipe, got that yeah. triple snipe when he was <laughs> streaks yeah. out the wazoo. He oh, was, I remember he Sim was snipe Katie at that event. Yep. Them consistently. Yeah, it was so I, I think when I when I look at him, he was just incredible that entire event. He came in and was just really all eyes were on him. Uh and he's continued to be great since then. But um no, I think BO4 Simp uh Simp at Champs was really something special. Three good picks. Pac-Man always laughs at me when I do mine. 
No, I was no shit. Sip the Black pick Ops 4 is a never good laughed at you. I loved watching Arklov. Yeah, you know what? Never mind. <laughs> Cancel Katie's. We're good to go. <laughs> That's all I, I, I like Arklov. It was fun to watch. It was my favorite map to watch. Well, Arklov like people just Arklov okay. Peak. Well, that's a terrible answer. So I don't. I mean, See, maybe you're right. You on me. Arklov yeah. Peak. Ar I like that map. <laughs> Katie, I'll be honest. You've had some very questionable answers in the past, but the simple one is good. Simple one is good. Simple one is good. He's going Thank crazy. You. We have, uh, we have formal <laughs> Crim, Aches, and of course, Simp. Those are some of our choices for the greatest individual performances at Champs. Guys, we'd love to know yours in the comments. Please let us know who do you think really had that standout that is above all of the rest. Give us your responses below and let us know if you think Pac-Man bullies me too, guys. <laughs>